first, though, mysterious death in Volusia County. A man found dead at a park. Deputies are calling it suspicious, and his family is confused over all this tonight. We're told the park hasn't even been around for a year. Good evening to you. I'm Eric Von Aken. Glad you're with us. Tonight, neighbors who know the man tell News 6 that he was a nice guy. They don't know how this could have happened to him. Deputies say they found his body around 2 this afternoon on Montecito Avenue in Deltona. News 6's Clay Lapard is there live tonight. Clay, this is a mystery not just for detectives, but for people in this neighborhood. Indeed, Eric, behind me is Montecito Park here, and that's neighbors tell us that this park hasn't even been open for about a year. You can see the relatively new jungle gym. There's a swing set right over there. And not far from this area where a lot of those neighborhood kids play is where one neighbor says they found a body in this park. And deputies say they're ruling this death suspicious. The Volusia County Sheriff's Office helicopter circled this park in Deltona. And deputies continued to investigate how a body ended up in this park on Montecito Avenue at around 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Deputies aren't releasing a whole lot of details about the person who was found here, other than this death is being considered suspicious. But we spoke with people at this park claiming to be his family. They say he was a man in his late 40s who was an overall nice guy with his own faults. And they have no idea how he ended up here or how he died. That was very shocking and scary at the same time because... I mean, you see the kids every day, and you're thinking they're not going to run into something like that. Not here. Isair Ginter walks around the park almost every day and admits this is quite the mystery for her quiet community. She says some people worried when the brush was cleared to make way for this park. Now, like many others here, she wants to know what happened. We need to know. What are we looking for? I mean, what, should I be walking on the street? What if it's just some random person who was walking? And again, we will keep you updated as this investigation continues and more information becomes available. In Volusia County, Clay Lapard, News 6. Clay, thank you.